to our channel. So, yeah. Oh. Before we get stuck in, don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel so you guys are a part of the wool family. Um, and as you can see behind me, it's a mess. The past few vlogs, I'm pretty sure you guys have noticed that there's a big ass pile on top of our racks. And it's not because we're lazy. Could be semi half. But it's because that these little things that I got from Kmart don't hold that much clothes and me and Wool have accumulated a lot more clothes. So, look at my side. Bear. It's what we want. And then look at Wool's side. Which is what mine was until I took all my clothes off the top. So, all my clothes are scattered all on here. As well as the girls because I just brought in the washing. And all down there. You guys can't see it. I don't know if I should show you. It's kind of embarrassing. But yeah, I'm gonna go sort through my clothes and I'm just gonna chuck some out. Gosh. So it is freaking cold outside. And I've had to hang my washing up. Like well, it's just my jeans and a top. But I've had to hang my washing and the girls' clothes all on the like the bar here and like on the basket, like on the two baskets that are down here. And they are putting other clothes in there. Uh, toddlers. They thought that they were helping me, which they're not, but that's fine. I have a meet up today at 11.30, so it's like an hour and a half. Um, hopefully that's enough time for me to kind of get this room looking a bit together. Literally, all I'm really focused about is my clothes and like the girls clothes the girls clothes are fine i just put them in their little drawers but my clothes so i'm gonna go through my clothes and see what i wear and what i don't wear the don't wear ones are going to be going in a pile over here next to the door and then i'm going to get a rubbish bag put them all in there because i have two other rubbish bags that are over there where the girls mattresses are but i cannot wait guys i'm so freaking excited this room is going to be changed hopefully hopefully by early next week oh, I cannot wait because it's just gonna make life so much easier to be honest like this whole room is just gonna be different like right now it looks like a bomb just came in and it was like it's gonna be completely different like there's not gonna be a cot here anymore well it's actually a toddler bed not gonna be a toddler bed anymore next to mummy and daddy's bed we're not gonna have Ada sleeping with us. We're not gonna have this computer in here with us. We're not gonna have these racks of clothes that keep getting bigger and bigger with us anymore. That's not gonna be on the wall anymore. Like, I'm so freaking excited. The lounge room is all going. I'm excited. I'm so excited for that. I'm so excited to show you guys what we're actually going to be doing to this room. So for now, I'm just going to sort out my clothes because I feel like it's... They're playing surprise, by the way. I feel like it's so cluttered. It really is, though. Of clothes that I've accumulated from work. It's literally just all work clothes, okay? Like, I still have the same clothes from, like, two, three years ago. I'm fine with that. I'm fine with that. Yay. But since working at my work, I need to obviously keep up with what's coming in and out type of stuff. So I have a lot of stuff accumulated. But yeah, enough talking because I feel like I talk a lot. I'm trying to minimize that. Um, you guys are going to see me. I'm probably going to speed through it because I don't want this to be 25 minutes long. I'm going to speed through this and you guys are going to see what I throw out and what I don't throw out. And yeah, I've already done the girls' clothes. I did it a few weeks ago, so they're fine. They literally have nothing. So they literally have no clothes at all, but that's fine. We're going to do a big shopping spree thing for Ava and Natalina. Mainly Ava because she doesn't have size 3 clothing. But let's jump into this video.
I just sorted everything out because I had this whole basket was full as well underneath and it had just random shit on there but the first clip that you guys would have seen with all that on the floor that was literally everything that was on top and tucked behind the back I know that's actually really bad I didn't realize how much shit I had and I watched this decluttering by I forgot her name on Netflix and she always says yeah. Pull all your clothes out onto the bed and it truly gives you an idea of how much clothes and clutter you have. So I have made one big ass pile right here. I'll show you guys in a minute. I'm about to just fold all my jeans and put all my belts and just organize them all in this basket. Then I'm going to put it away and then I'm going to put all my dresses. I don't know if I'm going to hang them up because it's already getting full and I don't really wear dresses unless it's like in a special occasion. I'm going to show you guys the pile that I'm going to throw everything out. When I mean throw I'm just going to take the salvos. Um, but it's literally just stuff that's been sitting there I've only worn once for an occasion. I don't wear it again. Things that I've brought on holiday and I only wore them on holiday and then they just kind of sit in that basket so I'm going to show you guys the progress pile guys all of this is what I am giving to Salvo so all right we are all done all right so I officially just made the bed I put everything in the bag that needs to go to Salvo's. It's 11 now, so I have half an hour to get myself ready, the girls ready. Should be enough time. Um, the place is only not that far from my house. But, um, yeah, so I've cleaned there. Are we going to get changed? Yeah. Alright, so this is what Ava's wearing. This is what Natalina is yeah. wearing. I'm going to get these girls ready and then I'll be back. We just finished up at the meetup and now we are about to go and have like a semi little play date with Tash. And I'll sh show you guys with Tash and her daughter. And we actually went to school together. So it's fun that we're finally catching up. But we're going to go to a park and the girls are going to play for a bit before I have to head out to go to work. So we'll see you guys there. She didn't want to leave the P L A Y G R O U N D. No, I don't want to say it out loud because then she's going to start up again. But she's fighting with Natalina over nothing because Natalina is talking to her and she doesn't want to talk. Blah, blah, blah. So, yeah, I am just heading to Nona's right now. I didn't realize how crazy traffic was, but we're heading to Nona's because I have work tonight, which is funny because I don't ever work a Thursday night. But I'm excited to work a Thursday night as well to see how it is. So that's what I'm about to do. Is it really loud? Can you even hear me? Let me 
turn my indicator off. Like, people already know I'm turning right. Heading to Nana's now. I'm dropping the girls off, and then I'm going to work, and then Wall's coming to my work, and then, um, we're gonna swap cars so then he can take the girls home. So that's gonna be fun. But yeah, today was a really good day. I got some things done. I did my clothes, which I feel like makes the room look so much more better and cleaner, I guess, instead of so cluttered. But um, like I said before, early this morning, the room is gonna have like a big facelift. Well, for me, it's gonna be a big facelift. I don't know if it's gonna look the exact same in your guys' eyes, but it will definitely be an improvement for us. Sorry, I'm excited to show you guys what's happening Mommy. with that. Yes, baby. My car just acted so weird just then. What the action? But yeah, so we had a really good day today. Um, met up with a few mums, which was awesome. Um, so that was pretty cool. Having... Um, Having a meet up with a few mums and their babies was so freaking cute. Um, I can't wait to meet up with a few of them again. Me and um, Natasha just went off um, and took the girls down to the playground um, because she wasn't doing anything and I'm not doing anything until like another hour and a half. So I'm like, let's just go to the park. So we decided to take them there. They had a good time. Ava almost fell through that bridge thing. like. When I say almost, I mean she did. I just caught her and that was the most biggest scare for me. So I'm like, nah, we're going home. Planned another play date, but she is pregnant and due very soon. So um, hopefully when we see her again, um, she will be due. So I'm excited for baby cuddles. But um, besides that, guys, the girls are probably going to fall asleep. They haven't had to sleep all day. We've been up since. 9, 8.30, 8.30, so we've been up pretty, pretty early and I haven't had a nap all day, so that's also great. I'm feel, I'm going to feel sorry for my grandma, my nunna, because she's the one that's going to have the girls right now, so. Sorry, Nona. I'm going to end this vlog right here because I am driving and um, there's nothing more to really film because I'm going to be at work, so um. Oh, and I broke it now while I was putting my freaking shoes on, which is bloody annoying. But don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe to our channel. Make sure you turn on post notifications and that little bell button so you guys get notified every time we upload. And we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.